So everyone's favorite part has got to be checking out all the coral yes. here. Mm -hmm. And there is a lot of it. This is the retail uh, side of their coral. They do have a coral farm we're going to check out in a little bit. So tell me kind of the layout and what we have going on here. So we do have um, six independent systems. We do kind of run the parameters, kind of depending on what type of coral we're keeping in there. Um, like this one right here is going to be a lot of bigger colonies, mostly LPS. Uh, we do have a lovely gem tang in here as well, but our bigger gonies, cinerinas, lobos, trachees. This is our um, frag bar section over here. So this is kind of going to be like where some of the beginner friendly stuff is, smaller frags, stuff we grow a lot of really quickly so we can pass the savings down to you guys. Um, it's the 10, 20, 30, and 40 dollar frags. Awesome. Um, so a lot of people will come and pick and choose, you know, Sometimes during sales, we'll do like buy three, get one free, or buy two, get one free. Nice. Uh, a lot of really nice gems and, you know, good finds in here. So That's a th great thing because, like, stuff you grow a lot of, you know, that way someone getting into it or more on a budget yes. can still get a lot of nice corn. Have a, I mean, there's a lot to choose from here in there's a budget probably, area. Yeah, there's probably, like, four or 500 different frags in yeah. here. and. You know, we do this because we understand that people starting out don't always want to drop $100, $200, $300 on a frog. They yes. want to be able to get a couple of tester pieces or something easy. Mm -hmm. um, and even the more seasoned hobbyists, they just, you know, it's the husbands that are trying to stay <laughs> on a budget or, you know what I mean? Um, and there's a lot of, I see just anywhere from Zoanthids, I see chalices, there's SPS, there's Fabia. So it's yeah. not like it's just like all bread and butter or yep. normal stuff. So it's a lot of variety. Great deal. So um, I'm sure this is a very popular section. <laughs> yeah. Yes. This is a very popular take. Um, and then down over here, we're going to have um, another big LPS system. It's mostly colonies. So mm -hmm. trachees, lobos, acan colonies. Some nice um, acans. We do have some really nice blue maxima clams in here right now too. Um, some philias. Everybody's favorite tank. All the euphelia, torches, frog spawns, hammers. Um, we've got some really nice orange torches, um, some really yeah, nice green wants hammers. Yeah, the euphelia family. Torches, hammers, frog spawns, they're flowy. Yeah. They have a lot of color, they're awesome. Um, I do have to stop because I haven't seen one of these before. Little mini red carpets. They're yes. adorable. They don't really get any bigger than that. Yeah, perfect for nano tanks. They add a really nice pop of color. They're just a true red in this hobby, which you don't find very right. often. Um, and they're just so cute. Like I know, they're I like had little to stop. pillows. I was like, what is this? <laughs> and they're really, really cool. Yeah, looking. those guys are super cool. Got some more frags here. Yep, so mostly zoas. We do have some trumpets. So you know, we just we grow those things so fast. So we just threw them in there. Um, this section is going to be more of like some of the higher end collector stuff. Uh, blastos, collector favias, mm -hmm. chalices. So this um, is the, kind of the named area, or just a little bit higher end. Yeah, a little uh, bit more frags. higher end, you know, between like the 50 to $75 range instead okay. of, you know, like the frag bar stuff. But some really nice collector chalices, um, like some orange crushes, space invaders. Um, There's a lot of color happening in here. Yeah. Galaxias. And all of this, all the frags here are grown Yeah, here. so everything you see here is going to be grown out in our aquaculture facility. Um, the only thing that I would say we're not currently growing right now are like scullies and trachies. Just, you know, Man. it's almost impossible. So, <laughs> yes. um, so basically, I mean, you're you're running, I'd say, 80% aquaculture probably 80, here? 80% aquaculture, That's yeah. amazing. You know, we yeah. always are talking about aquaculture and how it benefits the environment and trying mm -hmm. to go as much aquaculture as possible between fish and coral. Yeah. So seeing something that's this full of coral yeah. and almost all of it being grown here at your farm is yeah. really awesome. Um, and you definitely want to look for places like that or like you said they have all these stuff online available yeah, for sale. Yeah we do offer all of these frags online as well. Um, we just we want to push towards that sustainability not only just because it is better for everybody but we're able to make sure that they're tank hardened, they're pest free, they're going to retain color yeah. uh, and that they're just going to survive. You know these corals that have been grown in captivity are able to handle parameter swings a lot easier a lot than hardier. something that's just coming out of the ocean. So and right now it also is harder to find yeah. corals. Yes. So there's a lot of restrictions and bans that are happening mm -hmm. because of the toll that this is taking. The reefs are taking, yeah. Yeah. So 
this, you know, is saving the reefs, yeah. allowing you to have a ton of different variety yep. for people without taking it from the environment. Yeah, which is awesome. So you can see Absolutely. we got a whole long line. Yep, it goes beautiful all the way down here. Um, these are our. They're not, you know. They're rose bubble tips, but they're just not your ordinary rose bubble tips. They're just incredibly bright. They're very, um, very bright. One of our little Da Vinci's is hosting. You can or see the, close them up is hosting the cloud. Yeah, there's a little guy right there. They're beautiful. Um, some acans, um, some encrusting corals, cyphastrias, clove polyps. What a great and selection then, yep. everywhere. And then this is kind of just our um, almost stepchild tank right now. We need to. <laughs> And everything. <laughs> this is our, um, what do you call it, when you throw everything together, a hodgepodge. Hodgepodge. Yeah, it's got right. a little bit of everything. It's you got to have one of those. SPS. Yeah. <laughs> well, this, so, uh, <laughs> well, there's definitely, if you ever come to Living Reef here at the retail yeah. store, there's a ton to choose from. It's all beautiful and super healthy. Mm -hmm. I think we get to check out the farm now. Yes.